Hello, gardening enthusiasts. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we have an exciting topic for you all. Growing tomatoes at home and getting high yields. Tomatoes are not only delicious but also versatile in cooking. So, let's dive right in and discover some simple tips that will help you achieve bumper tomato crops in your own backyard. Also kindly subscribe to this channel if you have not. Let's get started. Tips number one is choosing the right tomato varieties. The first step to success is selecting the right tomato variety. Consider factors like your climate, available space, customers' needs and personal preferences. Some popular varieties for home gardening include heirloom tomatoes, cherry tomatoes, and determinate or indeterminate varieties. Determinate varieties are great for limited space, while indeterminate ones are perfect if you have ample room for sprawling vines. Choose the ones that suit your needs best. Tips number two, starting seeds indoors. Starting tomato seeds indoors gives them a head start and increases your chances of a successful harvest. Begin by filling seed starting trays with a high quality potting mix. Plant your tomato seeds according to the instructions on the seed packet. Provide adequate moisture and warmth, and in a few weeks, you'll have healthy tomato seedlings ready for transplanting. Number 3. Preparing the Soil Tomatoes thrive in nutrient-rich soil, so it's essential to prepare your garden bed properly. Clear the area of any weeds or debris and loosen the soil using a garden fork or tiller. Incorporate organic matter such as compost to enhance fertility and drainage. Aim for a slightly acidic soil pH between 6.0 and 6.8 for optimal tomato growth. You can also add some crushed eggshells to provide calcium, which helps prevent blossom end rot. Tips number 4, Transplanting Tomato Seedlings Once your tomato seedlings have grown to a suitable size, it's time to transplant them into your garden. Choose a sunny location with at least 6 minutes 8 hours of direct sunlight per day. Dig a hole large enough to accommodate the root ball of the seedling. Gently remove the seedling from its container, place it in the hole, and backfill with soil. Water the seedlings thoroughly and mulch around the base to retain moisture and suppress weeds. Tips number 5, Proper Watering and Fertilizing Watering is crucial for tomato plants, as they need consistent moisture throughout their growing season. It's crucial to avoid overwatering or underwatering them. Water deeply but infrequently, ensuring the soil remains evenly moist. 
avoid overhead watering only water the base of the plant this will encourage the roots to grow deep and develop a robust root system and also minimize the risk of diseases additionally fertilize your tomatoes regularly with a balanced fertilizer or organic amendments to provide them with essential nutrients like nitrogen phosphorus and potassium this will promote healthy foliage growth, robust root development, and, of course, abundant fruit production. Tips number 6, Staking and Pruning Tomato plants tend to become top-heavy as they grow, so staking is vital for proper support and to prevent sprawl. Staking will help keep the plants upright and ensure good air circulation. Remember to tie the stems gently to the support structure, taking care not to damage them. This will prevent the plants from collapsing under the weight of the fruit. You can use cages, stakes, or trellises depending on the tomato variety. Pruning is another important technique to improve airflow, reduce disease susceptibility, and enhance fruit production. Remove suckers, which are the growth that emerges from the leaf axils, and focus on maintaining one or two main stems for indeterminate varieties. Tips number 7, Pest and Disease Management. Keeping pests and diseases at bay is essential for a bountiful tomato harvest. Regularly inspect your plants for common pests like aphids, tomato hornworms, and whiteflies. You can use organic pest control methods like handpicking or spraying neem oil to control them. Also, be vigilant about fungal diseases like blight or powdery mildew. Consider using appropriate fungicides if necessary. Congratulations! By following these simple tips, you're well on your way to growing abundant tomatoes in your own backyard. Whether you're a seasoned gardener or just starting your green journey, there's nothing quite as satisfying as harvesting your own homegrown tomatoes. Remember, patience and consistent care is the keys to success. So, get your hands dirty, enjoy the process, and soon you'll be relishing the delicious fruits of your labor. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more gardening tips and tricks. Happy gardening!